Hey guys, it's Megan. Welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to share my recent Dollar Tree finds. I am so excited with the things that I found. This is not a huge haul, but it has so many things that I'm excited to use and try and just have. So make sure to give the video a thumbs up if you love Dollar Tree hauls. And if you're new, I would love to have you subscribe. Right now my Dollar Tree has out their Mother's Day cards, the ones that are a dollar a piece instead of 50 cents, the ones that are a little bit nicer. So I picked up a couple because I wasn't sure which one I wanted to use for my mom. They had a bunch of good options I think like different styles different you know colors and patterns and all of that I however picked up one that I should have paid a little bit more attention to I like the overall design of it and I thought it was pretty I love what it says but as I got home and I opened it and I looked at it I realized there was like glue that you can see on it so that was a bit of a bummer so pay attention when you are picking out a card that especially if it has like something that's glued on it just Make sure it looks like how you want it to look because this looks a little sloppy Dollar Tree, but it's all right. It's still, it's still a cute card for a dollar. It looks like this and it has these butterflies on it, but if you can see right here, that's like some glue left over and then there's like kind of like, sl it's like sloppily, sloppily is that a word? Glued where the rhinestones are. Other than that though, I think it's a really pretty card. I love what's written on it and on the inside, so Still a pretty card. I also picked up this card that just says best mom ever. I love that it has like the glitter on the inside, the glitter letters. I'm not the biggest fan of this little bow there, but the rest of it I think is really cute. Especially if you have a mom that likes pink and glitter. If you're needing a Mother's Day card, I would definitely check Dollar Tree soon because they're like nicer cards tend to go pretty quick, at least the good ones do. Okay, the next thing I found, I've never seen Dollar Tree carry before and it is this foil mom balloon thing like how cute is this i used some of dollar tree's foil balloons for my daughter's birthday back in january and they worked great they looked cute way cheaper than what they cost at party city so when i saw that they had a mom one i was like oh my god it looks like from the package that it was like a rose gold so i opened it up when i got home and it is it's like a rose gold pinky color which i think is so pretty it comes with a little thing to inflate it you just like blow in this little stick thing and it inflates it's super easy i thought that this would be so great if you're doing like a mother's day breakfast or mother's day brunch or lunch or anything like that and you want to like decorate a little area i thought that would be really cute dollar tree has out some new makeup and i shared some of it in my dollar tree shop with me that i posted on wednesday but this i think is new i'm not positive i don't always look at the dollar tree makeup when i go in there so this might not be new but it was new to me and it's by sinful colors i already took it out of the package it is this gel eyeliner. They had it in a bunch of really pretty colors. They had like a really light purple color, but I got the dark purple. They also had a black. It feels creamy when you put it on your hand and it's like a real pretty dark purple color. I'm excited to give that a try. I wanted to try it in my waterline and see if it stays there, how it looks there. Um, my last Dollar Tree haul, I shared some other Dollar Tree makeup that I got and I asked if you guys would be interested in seeing like a get ready with me using Dollar Tree makeup or some Dollar Tree makeup or like a Dollar Tree wear test on the makeup. A lot of you guys said in the comments that you would be interested in that. So I'm going to try and get that filmed next week and I will test out this gel eyeliner as well in it. I also picked up this LA Colors little mascara. I don't think this is new and I don't actually need mascara for my upper lashes is that what it's called yeah my top lashes that's the word um because i do have eyelash extensions right now but i have been out of mascara to put on my lower lashes lower lashes my goodness so i decided to get this and give this a try instead of spending like you know eight nine or more dollars on a mascara at the drugstore or like ulta or sephora i'm not sure if this will work well but i figured i would go ahead and do this in the Dollar Tree makeup test thing and put them on my lower lashes, see if it smudges, if it bleeds, if it crumbles, all the things that can happen to a mascara flakes, I don't know crumbles, but you know, flakes off at all. Give this a little test too. I also found some new of the Bolero cleansing facial wipes. I don't necessarily use these to take off my makeup. Every once in a while, like in a pinch, I will use them. But I like to put them at my makeup area and like whenever I randomly swatch something on my hand or I get makeup on my hand, I will just use one of these to wipe it off. I opened this and it does not smell, it's supposed to smell like coconut and rose oil, which I love both of those smells. I opened, but it does say made with natural coconut and rose oil. But I opened it up 
and that is not the smell that it gives me. I it smells very chemically chemically to me. I don't know, but the packaging though, let's talk about the packaging. The packaging they did a good job with. It really drew me in. I thought it was so pretty, so summery. The smell, not so much. I will use these though for taking makeup off my hand, like right now, and just keep it in my makeup area. But to use as like a makeup remover, I don't think so. I don't know why I just went, but let's go with it. Ooh, I found a new notepad. I think this notepad is so pretty. It has little lemons on it, and I love like the lined, like, striped white and yellow i thought this was just so pretty it's just like screamed summer to me spring summer i keep one of these notepads in my drawer in the kitchen so whenever i run out of a particular grocery item or anything like that i just jot it down in here and keep like a running list my list pad ended i ran out of paper so i found this one and i just loved it so much I also found some new flip flops. These are obviously little, so they're not for me. They are for my daughter. I shared in my Dollar Tree shop with me. I think a lot of the Dollar Tree flip flops and these just stuck out to me. I'm such a sucker for pink and this like limey green color, especially for summer. It draws me in and I just think it's so cute. I love that it's like the little watermelons. You know, Dollar Tree's flip flops aren't the greatest flip flops, but I think that, you know, wearing around the house or wear out by the pool or even like to a water park, I think they do fine. Like, but you know, wearing them for long periods, probably not the best, but you know, short periods, super cute and expensive. Can't go wrong. I always pick up these Citronella Skeeter Beater candles um, during the summer at Dollar Tree. I think they work really great. I got the little pink one. They have them like yellow and blue. These, you know, just repel mosquitoes. I think they do an okay job um, repelling the mosquitoes. And I personally love the smell of citronella. I know some people hate the smell of it. Let me know in the comments below. Are you one of those that love or hate the smell of citronella? I don't know why I love it. Mm, but there's just something about that smell that I really really love so had to grab one of these I also picked up these really cute paper plates. I think these are so Adorable these just scream summer and I think that they are just so cute I had to grab them Dollar Tree has these glasses out every year during the summer They're just their BPA free stemless plastic wine glasses. I love these however seeing them not in Dollar Tree and in this light, I picked up awful ones. They are super scratched. I have been having a bad habit of picking up things without really paying attention to them, but they'll be okay. They will do the job for by the pool. I love these glasses because they're just like chic and I think they look good on a patio table if you're doing like a little barbecue or you're just having dinner with your family. So I wanted to get a couple of these because my last ones are just like worn out. They do, you know, only hold up for about a season or two, if you, especially if you drop them or you're rough with them. Okay, the rest of the stuff is what I was so excited to find. I am just, oh, I'm so excited about it. Okay, the first thing, I showed this in my shop with me. I could not resist this adorable little sign. Oh, it's so cute. I love that it says Oh Sweet Summer. I love the colors of it. They also had, <gasps> no, there, I'm just gonna fix that a little bit. My God, I have to start checking the things before I grab them. This also might've gotten messed up when I was had it in my backpack on my bike ride home from Dollar Tree. So it might not be Dollar Tree's fault. Regardless, it'll be fine. It's still so cute. They also had like a just plain yellow one, I'm pretty sure, but I had to get the pink because I like pink in the summer. It's not all completely flat. This lemon is like lifted off of it a little bit. And then this lemon up here is lifted off of it a little bit. I don't know what that's technically called. I probably am going to use this on my patio somewhere. I know it won't hold up for long, especially being on a patio, even though it's covered. Just like the moisture and stuff, especially with the humidity in Florida, I'm sure it won't last too long, but it should last a decent amount of time. Here we go. What I was so excited, the most excited to find, I got these flamingo with the greenery oh my gosh i love these so much so this is like the little serving tray they also had one that was like a triangle with like it was like squared at the bottom and then a triangle up top that was just a bigger platter and then they had one other little tray that was a little bit different shape than this but i just grabbed this one and then i also grabbed the plates because how could I not? Like these are so, so cute. I was so drawn to them and I just couldn't resist them. They are a good size. However, they are not dishwasher 
yeah, not recommended for use in microwave or dishwasher. So that's the only like downside with these plates to me, but I think it'll be okay because I just think that they're so dang cute. Uh, I wish I would have gotten the bowls and I actually went back to Dollar Tree the next day to go grab the bowls and the bowls were gone. So I may keep my eye out for the bowls. I don't necessarily need the bowls, but I'm just like, ah, I want the bowls too. I wanna do a little patio tablescape on my table with these plates, so had to grab them and obviously I want to use them with my family. We like to eat dinner outside a lot during the summer um, so I thought this would be cute to eat dinner off of. And then to go along with the plates I got these placemats because you know I had to get pink to go along with that. How cute is that with the little glass? Yeah! I think these placemats are a great deal for a dollar. They have them in like blue, green, red, and I don't know, maybe some other colors, but those are the ones I could definitely remember them having. Again, I just think they're a great deal for a buck. They're an easy way to decorate your table and make it feel festive. And uh, yeah, I'm really excited to decorate my patio table with all my new little summery stuff and then put this somewhere near there because I think it all kind of just goes. So that is everything I picked up at Dollar Tree. I hope you guys enjoyed checking out the things that I picked up. Let me know in the comments below what was your favorite thing that I picked up. And don't forget to give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And if you're new, I would love to have you subscribe because I do Dollar Tree hauls all the time on this channel. But that is it for today. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing rest of your day and I will see you in my next video. Bye!